Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited for this episode today because it's episode number three of our wedding series. I'm really loving this DIY because you're able to use this wreath all year round. Wreaths work for every single season. So I want to share this really easy idea with all of you. It doesn't have to be for weddings. As you can see, it is a backdrop for my backyard. This DIY is super easy. I got a lot of the materials just from the dollar store. I hope that you enjoy this tutorial and let's get to it. The first thing you'll need is a hula hoop and you can get that from the dollar store. They come in a variety of sizes so if you want small or big you have a lot of choices. I've also been using this jute twine which if you have been watching my last couple videos I've been using it obsessively because I don't know it's just I love the look of it. So because I'm exposing some of my hoop I will be wrapping this with twine. You can also spray paint it if you want to. Although if you want to cover the whole hula hoop with greenery or flowers, then you can skip this step. I got these faux plants from Dollarama and you can use real plants if you want to. I'm just using these ones as a base and then I'm putting real ones over top. Plan out how you want your greenery to go on your hula hoop and I'm using these green zap straps which is also from Dollar Store and they're really good because they're durable and it holds your plants in place. Alright, now that we have our main wreath all ready, we're going to move on to a couple ideas that you all can put in the middle of the hula hoop. So the first one is with a foam board from Dollar Tree and I'm literally free writing the word love in there and I'm using another hula hoop to basically measure the size of the word. Next, take an X-Acto knife. You want to make sure that that's really sharp and you're basically going to cut the word out just like this. Careful with the parts that are pretty thin because it may snap, but you can definitely always glue it back with a hot glue gun. Now I was going to leave it just plain black, but I wanted it to pop out more so I painted it gold and this you can customize to any color that you want. For our next idea, we are using the scrap pieces that we use to cut out the word love and we are going to use that to make a letter. Of course you can just grab another foam board if you don't have enough of these scrap pieces but we're definitely wanting to recycle them so we're just going to use that. These grass mats you've seen in my other video and they are also from the dollar store and we are basically going to cut this out. The wonderful thing about this is you can make this thick or thin, it depends on the look that you're going for. You can also trim this to any shape just like real grass which is awesome. And of course we gotta have some fairy lights which I have also been using in all of my wedding videos. They're super useful and we are just going to hide this under your faux grass just like so. To hide the battery part you're just gonna flip this over and you can tape down the wire. Also you can use some hot glue to secure the battery pack so that it doesn't fall. I got this fishing line from the dollar store as well and we are just going to use this to hang our letter up from our wreath. I love the clean look that this gives and you're also able to easily move the fishing line just in case your letter ever gets slanted. You can keep your wreath minimalistic but I have some absolutely gorgeous roses growing in the back of my yard so I'm definitely going to be using that on this beautiful wreath. All this time you Another very easy DIY wedding idea for all of you. If you like this tutorial, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you leave a comment down below and let me know what you think if you loved it. And if you loved it, make sure that you subscribe because we do a lot of these awesome DIYs every single week on this channel. I hope to see you soon and take care. All this time you thought we'd never pay the price.